When I started the Short Circuit Dream Fund in 2007, I didn't put much thought into marketing and expansion. I just knew I wanted to give sick children something to make their everyday life a little better. The name was sourced from a DJ business I started the year before. It was something I thought those around me would recognize and trust. And before we became a registered charity, much of my own earnings went into funding the cause. After completing our fifth anniversary celebration, a year filled with events all across Newfoundland and Labrador, it became obvious that something had to change. Our name, the Short Circuit Dream Fund, was not very memorable and was becoming increasingly difficult to market. Our board of directors was very localized, and even our constitution was full of inconsistencies. But hey, can you blame me? I was 15 years old when I wrote it. As founder and CEO, I'm excited to say that changes, changes, changes are here. Our constitution has been rewritten so that we can go public in the only way a charity can. Now, every resident of Newfoundland and Labrador is considered a member. Congratulations everyone, you've all helped make dreams come true for more than 20 critical ill children and many more to come. While we remain the same organization with the same mission, our name has changed to something simpler and more to the point, the Dream Fund. Thank you for your continued support as we keep putting smiles on the faces of sick children all over Newfoundland and Labrador. The Dream Fund, lifting hearts one dream at a time.